Welcome back to Get Bet. My name's Sunbite. We're continuing to play through Pokemon Uranium. And it's evening here, so we should be continuing into the evening in game. So let's have some fun. Oh, I gotta go back in game and click it. Ah, uh, no wonder. Okay. Well, now we gotta begin our Pokemon adventure. Da -da 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 Where are we supposed to go? I forget. Are we going? There we are. He's right over here. Hey there, Desiri. I want to show you and Theo how to catch a Pokemon. Can you go get him? He should be in his house. Oh yeah, that's right. He ran off crying. And I have to get him and bring him to the house. His house should be this one right here. Ah, oh, he's already talking to his father. Oh, and he's running off. What did you say to my son? He ran upstairs crying. And locked the door behind him. He won't tell me what's wrong or come downstairs. I swear if you did anything to hurt him. Oh. So that's how it is. So he got the weaker starter, and you beat him in a battle. I see. He deserves it. A harsh lesson, to be sure. But losing is as much a part of being a trainer as winning. Heart is, he had his heart set on the day being perfect. So losing right off the bat is somewhat of a shock. Well, tomorrow is another day. So you can go get another Pokemon. And crying won't solve anything. That's your lesson to learn. Dio! Come downstairs right now, young man! And? Oh, he's back. You can't cry every time you lose a battle. That's just part of being a trainer. But it isn't fair. The series got the better started than me. Now I'm never gonna win. Then you'll have to catch more Pokemon to balance out your team's weaknesses. Besides, a well raised Pokemon can still win, even at a disadvantage. There's no sense in giving up before you even begin. Hi. Now, Theo, I won't always be around to pick you up when you're feeling down. So try to be strong for yourself, okay? Siri, please be patient with my son. I don't know what voice I'm giving this gentleman, but it's all over the place. It's like he has a different voice every speech bubble he's got. He looks up to you. Oh, he's got something for the both of us? What is it? Ah! Your father, Kellyan, sent me these and told me to give them to you both when you began your journeys. Are they a form of Pokedex? A Pokepod! What's a Pokepod? It's indispensable. Plays music, includes a map of the region. Most importantly, it contains a phone that will allow you to stay in touch with each other and other trainers. Yay! Cool. All right, so now we must have the blue one, and he does bounce back quickly. Don't want to keep the professor waiting, so you should get moving too. Yeah, I don't know why that was on the different line. Won't see you or Theo again for some time. I'll stop by again. Oh, he's starting a new job soon. Supervising the construction of the new power plant Epsilon. Oh, it's the last place Lucille was ever seen. That's right, you were there that day. Best of luck on your journey, Desiri. Well, that's a problem. Oh, well. Well, let's go find the professor. Hello, I'm here. Now that you and Theo are here, it's time to begin your first lesson as a Pokemon trainer and a field research aide. Now watch closely. Wild Pokemon, as you probably already know, inhabit tall grass. It's not the only place. You can also find them in caves, water, and cities. I don't know where they would be in cities. Hmm. Take a few steps. Oh, there's one. A chin monk. They are very common. Orkinks. Ah, okay. So he's going to keep Orkinks. I wonder if he's going to evolve them throughout as we're playing. The next step is to weaken the enemy Pokemon to make it easier to catch. Scratch. We're battling outside of the battle? Oh, that's so strange. That's how it's done. Chin Monk are fairly easy. You're sure to encounter Pokemon that are a lot harder to capture. Might need to inflict them with status effects or use a special Pokeball. We know this. I've played so many Pokemon games, I'm so used to that. Alright, the only thing I need to get... Oh, did I get... Oh, now is where we get the Pokedex. An encyclopedia that updates itself whenever you encounter a catching a Pokemon. So how does it know? 
how I never understood how the Pokedex knew everything about the Pokemon. You just had to find it or see it or, like, look at it or something. And it already knows everything, but it won't explain it unless we find it. That's... Oh, he also gives Pokeballs. This is good. And the Pokeball pocket. Gotta catch him. Oh, you, uh, you make me sad. But yes, Bambo, keep up with the times. Moki Town doesn't have a Pokemart, but there's one in Kevlar Town on the other side of Route 1. And with that said, your lesson is now over. We have Pokepods. Oh, so now we can call the professor anytime we want. Alright. He might even give us some special rewards. Ooh, speaking of rewards, we need to do the mystery gift. Going back to the lab. Best luck on your journeys, both of you. Bye, Professor. I'm gonna go catch all the Pokemon. He doesn't care that I've got the stronger starter. He's still gonna be the best trainer ever and he'll catch tons of Pokemon and win every battle. Nope. Oh, I thought he was just gonna circle around there for a little bit. What's this? Nothing? It's just a branch. Oh, that's right, I needed to go see my mother before I headed out. She wanted... Oh no, Auntie. This isn't my house. Thank you. Come again. I must go say goodbye to Auntie in our lovely home right over here. Hello, Auntie. No? No? You wanted to see my Pokemon. I don't need to take a break. The kids, what? She let the kids play the Wii U. Nobody in my room. We're good. Alright, well, I guess you didn't want to see my Pokemon. Bye, Auntie. Alright, we're heading out of Moki Town. We're gonna go enjoy what's new. Oh, fantastic. And so the adventure begins on Route 1. Alright. And I'm at a loss as to what to do, where to go, who to see, what to do. So, I'm going to avoid all trainer battles until I can catch myself another Pokemon. Okay. A Kabug. I forgot, I, I did not forget I named it Masquerade. I'm just lying to make myself feel better. Okay. It's a level two. So, let's use, let's use Tackle and see what that does. Okay. What do you mean? My attack fell because I fell in love with the damn thing. It's so cute! Tackle! Oh wow, that attack harshly fell, and the string shot made my speed. Oh my god. Wow, it attacked first, but now you're paralyzed. Good job, kid. Take that. Alright, I'm gonna try and catch you. Pokemon. Alright, bag. Pokeballs. Go, Pokeball! Uh, yes, I want to use it. Throw the Pokeball. Catch the Kabog. It's only a level 2, I know. But now we know what a Kabog is. Or we will soon. Alright, it's data was added to the Pokedex. A love bug. <laughs> Characteristics with bug and mammal. And being in its presence is a calming effect. What I like... Of course I'm going to give it the name Lovebug. Lovebug. Okay. Well, there's our first Pokemon. Hi-ya! Whoosh, whoosh. I wonder if there's anything else out here. Burby. He's a Burby pur in a Burby world. I'm going nuts with this. Alright, let's just kill it with water. Which is going to be weak against flying. How did I not think of this? A critical hit? No. Okay. I'm honestly... I think I'm overhyping these battles. But I'm so excited to be... Oh, there we go. Now I can catch it. I'm just so excited to be playing another Pokemon game. After all of these years. Yes, I would like to use the Pokeball. Go! Catch it on the first try. A, B down. Yeah. Now we talking. 
Alright, it defends itself by dazzling opponents by flashing its brightly colored plumage. Known for their elaborate... Uh, elaborate... Elaborate what? Elaborate what? <laughs> yes. Future John will put all my trains of thought into naming these Pokemon every single time. <laughs> oh, that's great. Ah, 9, 6, B plus 2, attack plus 1, speed plus 1. Okay, I've never been one hyped up into the stats. It's just never, never been my, like, peak interest here. Ooh, one potion! Hello, you. Chin chin. Oh, you noticed me. Hello. Oh, they know me. Who is this kid? And why do they have a Pokemon before me? And why do they want to know what mine? What? School kid Taff. How does Taff know me? Oh God, a level five Chin Monk. And here I am with only a Masquerade and two other Pokemon that are half dead. Oh, good grief. This is not gonna end well. Let's water gun it to death. What do you mean it used tackle? Heck no. Oh, you're paralyzed now. Great, so now I should have the advantage. That didn't do a whole lot. Alright, let's try again. I think one more should do it. Or maybe tackle, I don't know. Let's tackle it. Oh, no. So close. We're gonna heal after this. Tackle. You're dead. Shaboom! Do I know how many Pokemon she has, or is it just that one? Yes, I'm going to switch my Pokemon. Because, even if Lugbug, Lugbug dies, I can heal Masquerade. That's what we're going for. Alright. It's a level 4 Burby. That must be the Pokemon she wanted to try out. Madison Potion. On Masquerade. Dun dun dun. Guess what? The HP was restored. Bye, Love Bug. We knew you well. You were paralyzed. That's probably what the status effect showing on your Pokeball was. And Masquerade switch in. Let's take care of business. Let's fight. It's just you and me. Alright, good. It's not very effective against me. A water type slash electric type. It's gotta be electric. Okay, one, the colors. Two, the lightning bolt. that l It clearly looks like a lightning bolt on the side. Three, the dead giveaway for any Pokemon is having yellow orbs attached to them somewhere. Like Ampharos, for example. Or Mareep. I'm so close to evolving you, Masquerade. Well, not evolving, but leveling up. Yep. You're darn right, it's not. And I got 200 for just doing that. Okay. Do I want? I do want. Darn it! Well, I guess I'll just have to see what this Pokemon is. Oh, yes. You're gonna get me the next level. Water gun, go! What? What the heck happened? My accuracy fell. Why? Did you do an attack? I'm concerned. For my Pokemon's health. My mental status. There we go. Level 7. An antidote. Alright, made it out safely. What's down here? A house? Hello, house. Who's in this house? Hello, sir. You are a fisherman. Maria Nautoch City's gym leader. So once we beat Maria, we can come back and we'll prove... Oh, so your brother and sister. What the heck are you guys doing living out here? So we can prove that we are strong enough to get a fishing rod, I'm guessing. So let's just run back. 
I think the game's kind of glitching a little bit since I'm trying to record it at the same time. Not shocked. Just concerned. Come on, run. Okay, we made it through. Hello, auntie. Please heal. And then we can go back out. I'm so glad I can run inside. I love how she poses it as a question. Take a break, maybe? I mean, you've been running quite a long while. <sighs> to help set up the internet. Auntie, what would you do without the internet? Alright. Let's go. Alright, let's head down this time. I'm pretty sure there's a trainer down here who'd love to battle me. There you are. Ah, you just started. Well, why do I not know about all of you? Didn't you come from Moki Town? That's my biggest question here. Last Lynette would like to battle. Alton. Ah, so that's what that thing is. It's an owl kitten. Alton. What do I do? A tail whip? You identified me. Yes. I don't know what that does. I'm at a loss as to what identification does. But your defense has fallen, and I will water gun you to death. Or till you faint. Why did you attack me first? Hmm. That didn't do as much as I wanted it to. Let's tail whip you again, and then we tackle. You ain't doing nothing. You're doing 2 HP at a time damage. Alright, Outen. Get ousted. Pack. Little kitten used pack. Whoa. Ooh, now's when I want some sort of quick attack. Ah, paralyzation. There's my quick attack, but it's a little late. Bye, Outen. There we go. Anyone can be a trainer. Yeah. Anyone can train. Not everyone should. Thank you for the cash. It was a dollar twenty, but it was worth it. Oh, what kind of berries are these? Oran berries. Oh, so they even use the same berries as before. Soft and loamy state. Didn't know berries. Didn't know dirt had a loamy state. I actually want to know what loamy means. Oh, guess I can't go up there. I gotta, gotta go down the other way. Okay. Why are you playing so slow? Game, keep up. What would it be like if I didn't beat her and saved her until the very end and then came back and was like, guess what? Hello, sir. Fortog. I don't know what Fortog are. Poisonous Pokemon? But I do have an antidote. Thank you, sir. Uh, hello. I remember the first time I found one of these things on the ground, I thought it was a Pokemon that was just left alone. It was the strangest thing. Alright, so there's nothing down here. I'm sure we'll be able to swim eventually. Yeah, I want to battle you. Or I can battle a new Pokemon. Hello, little Cubbug. How are you? Look how bug I'm a f I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to water gun you. Woosh, woosh. I remember the reason why I always pick fire now. Because it does so well against everything in its path. Because the first route is always grass Pokemon. So why wouldn't you pick it? I think I gave myself the disadvantage here. Oh, thank you for having a critical hit. Do I have time to bat? Shoot! I meant to press the escape button so that I could go into the menu. Oh no! Not bug catcher flood! Not a cub bug! Alright, let's see how you fare with this! A tackle attack! Masquerade static. Paralyzes you. Oh. I promise I will do some grinding off camera, or maybe on camera. Maybe I'll do it in a stream. Either or. 
at some point, though. Yeah, tackle me. It's only doing two and two. I think this guy has two Pokemon, though. I haven't been paying attention. It's in the bottom corner, I think. Will I switch Pokemon? Nah. Is this... It's a higher level Kabug. Yeah, he does have two Pokemon in the bottom left right there. Alright, let's see... Do I Water Gun? Because it should do a little more damage, even if you are resistant. Maybe. I actually have no idea. Alright, what I'm going to do, though, is if I get anywhere near 5, I'm going to give you a potion. Actually, if I get below 7. 5! Time to potion. Use on Masquerade, please. Ah, near full health. I think after this battle, what's going to happen is Masquerade's going to level up. This is so interesting to see what they've done with this. Weren't you paralyzed before? Oh, that was the other one. Take this! Ha ha ha! You are down now. There we go, level 8. This is good. Bug catcher flood? That was wicked. Okay. Oh no. Please don't see me. An antidote. Oh, of course it would happen right as I step to the right. So it seems there are only a couple different Pokemon up in this area. I wonder what would be the Pikachu of this game. I'm curious. I'm wondering if it is that Outen. Oh shoot, no! I wanted to tackle. Now this battle is going to last a little longer. Oh boy. Yes, the accuracy has fallen. Tackle. What do you mean I missed? It's because my accuracy was lowered. Oh no. No, don't miss this. Thank you. Just end the battle. <sighs> okay. Let's get out of here. Skidoozers, I can't go that way? Are you kidding me? Alright, how are my Pokemon right now? Pokemon, how you doing, guys? Alright, Masquerade, you're still doing well. Candy Love Bug. Mm -hmm. Really need to level you guys up. But we'll get to that eventually. Yeah, I can't run away from you. You're a Pokemon trainer. I'm gonna... Oh, I could've walked around you, though. Good. All right, Richie Rich, a Fortog. Whoa. What if it was a Frodog? You're probably not weak to this, but let me attack with it anyway. Yep, not at all. Great. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, so let's do some tackle attacks. How do you fare against these? A little better. Oh, my gosh. But you're paralyzed now, so this is good. That's the one thing I like about this water electric Pokemon. You never know what to expect. As long as you don't crit me. No, 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 no. We are gonna heal. I'm gonna use my last potion on you, Masquerade, because I don't think a level 2 or a level 3 is gonna be able to finish this off. Alright. Let's end this. Crit, please. Darn. Okay. I got you. Masquerade, go! Took down the Fortog. And Richie Rich was defeated. And, oh, crackers! I lost. Pretty good. Pokepod numbers? Sure. What if I said no? What if I said no? I would have laughed. Alright, it's time to go into the next area, but I think we'll do that next episode. This has been really fun. I'm getting pumped. Oh boy. Oh, this is so much fun. Okay, before I forget, completely in zone out here. Thank you everybody so much for watching. 
I had a lot of fun playing this episode. Look forward to the next episode, whatever that may be. My name is Soundbite. Let's get bit. And I will see you around.